Hello everyone, I am Karthik Saini, primary teacher AECS 4 Rawat Bhatta. Today, I am going to teach you EVS for class 4th. So, let us start our chapter 2, year to year. As we all have studied about sense organs in the previous classes, ear is an important sense organ which help us to hear the sound. Similarly, the animals also need ears to hear the sound. Different animals have different kind of ears. We will see them in the next pictures. Here, the first picture is of the elephant. Elephant is having big ears. We can see them easily. In the second picture, we can see a deer and its ears are also easily visible. Let us see some more pictures. The first picture is of a buffalo and the second picture is of a tiger. Here also we can see the ears in these pictures. Here are some more examples. We can see the ears of some animals like elephant, deer, buffalo, tiger, rabbit, giraffe, mouse, dog, etc. Now let's move on to our next topic. Animals whose ears we cannot see. Now look at the picture carefully. In this picture we cannot see the ears of these animals. Some more examples are fish, crow, sparrow, snake, duck, frog, etc. Now look at this picture. Here is a bird, a lizard and a crocodile. A bird has tiny holes on both sides of its head. Generally, the holes are covered with feathers. They help the bird to hear. Also, there are tiny holes on a lizard's head. These are its ears. A crocodile also has ears like this, but we cannot see them easily. Now, our next topic is about patterns on animals. There are different patterns on animals due to the hair on their skin. Now we will understand this using a matching exercise. Here from the left side the first picture shows the pattern of a deer. The second picture shows the pattern of a squirrel. Now move on to the third picture it will show the pattern of a tiger. The fourth picture will show the pattern of a leopard. The fifth picture is showing the pattern of a zebra. Here we have to understand some animals which have hair on their skin are fox, cat, pig, camel, cow, buffalo, elephant, mouse, etc. Some animals which have feathers on their skin are hen, crow, sparrow, peacock, duck, etc. There are other animals also. Now let's move on to the next topic. Here we will learn about animals which give birth to young ones. Those animals whose ears we can see have hair on their body. These animals give birth to the young ones. Look carefully in this picture. You can see a dog and a dog is having hair and we can see the ears also. So this is how you learn that those animals whose ears we can see have hair on their body and these will give birth to the young ones. Now the next topic 
is about animals which lay eggs. Those animals that do not have ears on the outside do not have hair on their body. These animals lay eggs. Look carefully in the picture, we cannot see the hair or the ears. So this is why these animals lay eggs. Now let's move on to an interesting topic. So tell me, have you seen this animal? Well, this animal is nowadays can be seen only in movies. It's a dinosaur. Many years ago there were dinosaurs on earth, but not anymore. Now we see them in films, photos and books. Now move on to the last topic of today's lesson. Now you will have to guess the name of this animal. The hints are it is our national animal, it lives in forest. Yes, you got that right. It is a tiger. Tiger is our national animal. It lives in wild forest, grasslands, etc. The number of tigers are going down in India because people hunt them illegally for their bones and skin. Now to the end of this lesson, I hope you enjoyed. Now you can easily solve your worksheets. Thank you.